Although it doesn't feel too much like spring outside, spring sports are indeed back and better than ever. Purdue baseball and softball took to the mound yesterday for some midweek matchup games. So let's see how the Boilermakers were able to do. Starting off with Purdue softball, who hosted the Indiana State Sycamores for a doubleheader. And this was an important game for the Boilermakers. After all, it was their home opener and they wanted to start things off on the right note. But the first game would be a struggle for the team as they lose 6-2 and give up 10 hits. But I promise you, the second game went a lot smoother. I mean, right away, Purdue was playing a lot better defense than they did in the first game. Boilermakers kept making clutch plays to get the Sycamores out. And in fact, this team only let ISU put up two runs on them in the entirety of the second game. And good defense definitely led to good offense last night, especially in the bottom of the fourth when Alex Ichazareta would have herself a grand slam on the home opener and go 210 feet to put the Boilermakers on top, leading by four runs. The fifth year definitely showing up and showing out last night. And with that huge play, coupled with the fact that Purdue's bullpen managed to only give up three hits and have three strikeouts, it's no wonder the Boilers stole the second game 9-2. Purdue will be back in action this weekend on Friday as they open up Big Ten play against Nebraska.